This video provides information that may or may not apply to you and your specific vision or healthcare needs. Always consult your optometrist, therapist, or teacher before considering what you and your family should do in any particular situation. Optometric vision therapy must be prescribed and monitored by your family optometrist. The Base Out Lifesaver card is for patients who need to increase their ability to converge without effort. For this exercise, we will use the following, an opaque lifesaver card and a pencil tip. Lifesaver cards are therapy procedures that are often performed at home during phase one of the virgin's part of the optometric vision therapy. Patients should set up a total home therapy time schedule of approximately 20 to 30 minutes a day for five days per week, or as your doctor recommends. Practice the lifesaver card therapy for three to five minutes during each session. As it becomes easier, increase time up to 10 minutes. Patients should continue to perform this therapy until they are able to look at the floating 3D metal circle and keep it clear and single for at least five seconds for all four levels. The end point is when patients are able to perform this task without the aid of the pencil and when they achieve single, clear, comfortable binocular vision. Lifesaver cards can also be used as part of a maintenance therapy program which consists of one gross virgins technique and one fusional virgins technique, which include eccentric circles and lifesaver cards. Patients will be instructed to perform these techniques for a total of five to 10 minutes, three times per week after the final optometric vision therapy progress evaluation until the follow-up evaluation. Lifesaver cards are therapy procedures that are performed in a quiet area at home where distractions are minimal. Lifesaver technique is beneficial to patients who are unable to converge their eyes and maintain that eye posture. These patients may show the following symptoms. Headaches, eye strain, intermittent blur with near tasks, intermittent diplopia with near tasks, symptoms worse at the end of the day, and slow reading. Now we will demonstrate how to use the Base Out Lifesaver card. We will be using the opaque Lifesaver card to help move your eyes in. Hold the opaque Lifesaver card at a reading distance at eye level in one hand. With the other hand, hold a pencil right in front of the card so that it is positioned between the two lower circles. Look at the pencil tip and keep it single while moving it closer to your nose. As you move the pencil close to you, you should notice two circles at first, then four, then three, with the middle one being a mixture of red and green colors. The words clear these letters should be clear of all letters present. You want the middle circle to float towards you with all the letters being present. It should read, clear these letters. You do not want to see two red and one green. If you see this, it means your brain is turning off the input from your left eye. This is called suppression. You will also notice the words, clear these letters, will have missing letters if suppression occurs. If you see two greens and one red, your brain is turning off the input from your right eye, and you do not want this to happen. You will also notice the words, clear these letters, will have missing letters if suppression occurs. You also do not want the middle circle to be half green and half red. The color of the middle circle should be a mixture of green and red. To turn the signal back on and to decrease the suppression, you should blink a few times or slightly move the card side to side or up and down. This should keep the brain paying attention to both eyes so that you can see the middle circle the way you are supposed to see it. If you are able to see the proper three circles and keep the letters clear, slowly turn your head to the left about an inch and then to the right about an inch while you keep the middle circle single. Do not tilt the card or your head. Continue to turn your head up and down, then a small circle, clockwise and counterclockwise. 
you do not see the proper three circles, start over again. Push the pencil towards the lifesaver card. Slowly bring the pencil towards yourself. Once you are able to easily do the circles on the bottom of the card, move on to the next set of circles and then work your way to the top set of circles. Be sure you can keep the middle circle clear for at least 5 seconds. After completing 4 levels, start at the bottom set of circles again, but this time without using a pencil A. Once fixation is kept clear for at least 5 seconds, move up to the next level until all 4 levels are completed without the use of a pencil. As a review and to summarize the Base Out Lifesaver Card Optometric Vision Therapy Procedure, Step 1. Hold the Base Out Lifesaver Card at a reading distance. Step 2. Place a pencil in front of the card between the bottom red and green circles. Step 3. Look at the pencil tip, keeping the pencil tip single as you move it towards your nose. As you move the pencil close to you, you should notice two circles at first, then four, then three, with the middle one being a mixture of red and green colors. The words, clear these letters, should be clear with all letters present. Step four, if you are able to see the proper three circles and keep the letters clear, move your head side to side, up and down, and in small circles. Make sure you keep the middle circle single and clear with all letters present. Step 5. Once you are able to do the bottom circles, work your way to the top set of circles. Step 6. Once you are able to do all sets of circles, repeat it without the aid of a pencil. Continue doing the therapy until your doctor tells you to stop or to do a different therapy procedure. If you have questions, always contact your doctor. This therapy technique is only one of many you may use.